Hello everybody, Joe Marquez here once again to showcase for you a little tiny hack or a little uh, addition to a hack that I did a while back called the Flipgrid Grid Masks. Now, previously I created a grid mask where it's an actual mask, a face that a kid can put right on their face and pretend they're any animal in the world. And you can check that video out in our channel at any time. But also, we want to mask the video itself in Flipgrid to create something brand new. And so what I started doing is creating mask templates for a variety of different things that students love to do. So one of them is the Daily Prophet from um, the Harry Potter series. So what I did was I opened up a brand new Google drawing. And the uh, first thing I did was I went into the page setup and I made sure that the page was set up for widescreen 16 by 9. That is the best ratio to work in Flipgrid. Once I did that, I created this template right here for the Daily Profit. And basically all I did was create this image with shapes right here and also with PNGs that I found online. Like this Daily Profit is a PNG and a PNG means there's just no background data at all. So you can layer things right on top. So that's what all of these are, PNGs that I found right off the internet. And then I placed a location where I want the student's face to actually appear in Flipgrid. And I turned it into some color that doesn't represent anything on this page. Um, for this case, I went ahead and went with blue, but you can also go with uh, bright green, like in a green screen as well, because we're going to be removing this image right here. Now, how am I going to remove this image? Well, I always do things uh, in, in assumption that you don't, you, you are working with a Chromebook, meaning you can't install apps. So we're not going to be using anything fancy like Photoshop. We're going to be using something, a photo editor online called Pixlr. And this one is specifically Pixlr X. So what I'm going to do is once I've created this template, all I'm going to do is download it as a PNG. And then I'm going to go right into my Pixlr editor. I'm going to open the image right here. Here it is. I'm going to go ahead and open it. And once the image opens, I'm going to come over to my cutting tool and my magic cutout. So I went to the scissors, that's the magic cutting tool, and the magic cutout. And all I'm going to do is place the magic right there in the middle, and it will pull all the entirety of that blue off of that particular section. And that's exactly what I want. Now I'm going to select save. I want to make sure I save it as a PNG. And now I'm going to select download. So now I have that image with the middle cut out all over itself. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into Flipgrid and I'm going to actually create this um, as a topic for my students to utilize. So I already created one for you. Let me show you what I did. So what I did was in this topic, I titled it Daily Profit Grid Mask. I went ahead and upped it to 10 minutes just for practice right now. But if you want your students to talk no longer than a minute, you of course would select one minute. Flickr just updated it to 10 minutes to meet any remote needs that you're doing at the moment. Then I also just gave a little bit of a prompt um, here. You can change that uh, any way that you want. And then I uploaded a video of myself actually performing this activity. And then the, here's the big thing. I uploaded the daily profit image for my students to be able to utilize when they are uh, creating their Flipgrid video. So let me show you what it would look like. So I'm gonna go ahead and cancel this so I don't update anything. The students would come in here and they would see this screen right here. They would see the video that I recorded for them as an example right here. Let me show it for you just one quick second. Do you love Harry Potter? Have you always wanted to be in the movies? So that's the intro I would give to the students. You can do any intro that you want. And how would the students utilize this? Well, the first thing they would do is, it says right up here, they would download this mask onto their computer. So they would click on the mask. It comes up right here. And all the kids have to do, all the students have to do is click download. It'll download that mask right down onto their browser. Now, when they actually go in to record a video, they click the record, they make sure they log in with their Google account. And once they are logged in, all they're going to do is this. They're going to start the video. Hi, everybody. They're going to click on the photo sticker because that's basically what we created. We're going to click on it 
and we're going to upload the mask that we just created. That's the uh, PNG with the blue rectangle removed. There it is. I'm going to, because it's 16 by nine, all you have to do is bring it up to one corner and then bring it down to the other corner and it fits perfectly, nice and perfect. But in the Daily Prophet, the images of the people are actually muted, more like a, a gray tone. So we're gonna go ahead and select the filters here, black and white, and boom, now we have our Daily Prophet. So now we're gonna say this. The kids are gonna hit record. Three, two, one. Hi everybody, I love Harry Potter. And now I can be part of Harry Potter's, one of Harry Potter's best parts of the book and part of the movie, that's the Daily Prophet. I love how the magazine actually has the photos moving right there. And now I'm one of those movies. Because as you can see, I am a muggle who is joining the wizard gathering. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you can record your own. So they would hit next. Hi everybody. I love Harry Potter. And now I can be, they can rewatch, they can edit that video if they want. They just hit next. They're gonna do a quick video right here. Um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring that sticker back up. There we go. I'm gonna make sure that I mute it there. And then all the kids have to do is thumbs up. And um, of course, you can always bring in more stickers. One of my favorite stickers for this particular one is the Harry Potter glasses. Here we go. Put those right on top of myself right there. And hit next. Now there's their photo right there. They can give it a title. They hit submit. And complete. And so now they would be right here um, as, as soon as that tile appears. Now, if you would like your very own topic right here, you can actually find this in the Disco Library in Flipgrid, which means all you would have to do is click up here for Disco Library. And then under Search Topics, you type in Daily Profit. And you'll find it right there. And all you would have to do is click on it and add it to your grid. So it's already pre-prepared and pre-ready for you. If you'd like to try this out before you actually make one, please definitely come in here to my hack examples grid. And all you would have to do is go to flipgrid.com forward slash hacks. Once again, it's flipgrid.com forward slash hacks, and you'll have access to my hack grid where you'll see not only the Daily Profit mask, but you'll see my YouTube mask, you'll see my Iron Man hub mask, um, as well as a variety of other cool things as well you can try out. Thank you so much for listening, and I hope you have a fantastic time. Thank you so much, and have yourself a great day.